pam 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 Hello everybody, you're welcome to the program Step Out with your humble host Ibrahim. I'm here to serve you right, to serve you well, and to make sure you're enticed, to make sure you're entertained, to make sure you're sensitized, and to make sure that you're relieved from stress. Welcome again and again and again. You're on the best TV channel or uh, canal set. Oh my God, merci beaucoup Géraldine pour uh, voilà, le beau travail que tu effectues chaque fois sur les platines. Il faudrait dire qu'aujourd'hui, je suis tellement, tellement heureux parce que uh, notre émission est bénie des personnes exceptionnelles. Là. Et je dis un grand merci au PDG, voilà, M. Ouberni qui fait, uh, voilà, qui ne fait que émerveiller la capitale camerounaise du Cameroun. Hein. Voilà, il y a on est, on est en train de prendre de l'ampleur hein, et c'est ça. C'est le travail qui Pay. So, ladies and gentlemen, the program Step Out is here to make sure that you have a relaxed weekend. And we make sure we bring up uh, uh, interesting topics, we bring up entertainment, and we are open to promotion. If you have any initiative you want to promote, don't hesitate to get to us. We will give you the necessary platform that's us, as you can see, um, <laughs> to uh, promote whatever you're doing. That's why we have artists on our platform. That's why we have, uh, <laughs> you you know, uh, wonderful people will come talk about Im important issues. You know, the weekend is not only uh, you going out. Yeah, that's true because we talk much about tourism. But we notice that the weekend too is to sit is to sit at home and get educated and get sensitized. And that's why we got some wonderful person in the building today. Oh my God! If you know the story about this, you'll be shocked. And we are having youths who are taking over the industry. Good music will be served to you on our platform. And I'm so much um privileged because if it isn't because if it isn't because of you guys the program step i would have got so far gone so far oh my god i'm always smiling you know i want to say thanks so much to the aura designs for these she dressed me and i'm so grateful thank you so much grand sir it's a pleasure um i'm so happy each time i put on these i respect your work i respect what you do so uh sans vous droit perdre le temps on va prendre une petite pause musicale Géraldine. Et voilà uh, on a l'artiste rapan qui a fait un remix de euh, la chanson de Blanche Bailey Argent. Voilà, il serait avec nous sur la plateforme. On a aussi Tracy, right away from Boya. Oh my God, the star girl. Elle est gentille. Et tu veux la boule? I don't know if I sing so well, bird. We'll be having a straight on our platform. We have Breeze, Kana, baby. No, no, be baby. A big boy. <laughs> He's on our plan, so he'll be here uh, today. So, uh, Gérardine, merci beaucoup pour cette pause musicale. Je préfère à pas nuit, comme ça on s'amuse un peu, et puis on, on va uh, recevoir sur la plateforme notre première, voilà, invité sur cette merveilleuse plateforme. Oh là là. Merci beaucoup pour cette pause, et on revient tout juste après. C'est pas prêt Gérardine, c'est bon Balegi, Maganga, Maganga, la la la. Hey, c'est rap à nuit. Sous le beat de Blanche et Belly. Hey, oh, hey, oh, hey, oh. Les gars sont morts. Belly et Blanche, et c'est pas bon. Mais c'est sa life, moi je m'en tape. J'ai pas le temps, j'vois la lune cap. Pour chop la mba, pour tout la sang. On a avec, comme on l'a. La fille j'ai la yeux, c'est le vrac. Elle est belle, c'est le mens. Son âme, son visage m'a donné la règle. Je n'ai pas les pèses pour bailler les eaux 
Ah, la gauche, tu as les nouvelles de Rapa Nui Qui Le gars foiré là. Il est même barré depuis. Et en plus, on l'a envoyé au nord chez les Boko Haram là-bas. Ah, c'est le gars alors brisé. Il a eu la bouse. Il gomme Dans deux semaines. Ah, bon, eh. Maman, l'agent de ça. Maman, le gars là, ça va. Il joue mon téléphone. On m'a fait que à Maroche, tu ne peux vouloir la soi à distance. Dès que tu entends que je go en bain, qui est plus loin, là tu changes. Tu ne parles de mariage. Woko, wombo les femmes, avec le calculage. Si tu en calme ta rage. La jambe, l'homme de femme. La jambe, l'homme de femme. La jambe, l'homme de femme. La jambe. J'ajoute sur le bloc aussi que sauf la jambe, la jambe, la jambe, la jambe, la jambe, la jambe, la jambe. La jambe, la jambe, cap, l'homme de fa, abalé, gui, me ganga, la la la. Oh, Rapa Nuit, c'est ce jeune artiste qui est en train de prendre de prendre de l'ampleur dans la ville de Yaoundé. Je pense que c'est le cas avec tout le Cameroun parce que ce jeune homme, il est juste talentueux. Et euh, vraiment, j'ai été privilégié de rencontrer ce jeune homme. Et il hein, voilà, a été sur notre plateforme. Et je pense que c'est la deuxième fois. Beaucoup d'entre vous avez constaté que euh, l'animateur télé Ibrahim a été sur ce clip. Oui, j'ai été appelé. Voilà. Et j'ai fait ses pas là. Voilà. Le décalé chinois. Et les gens ont aimé. Voilà, c'est ça. Et on fait notre mieux. On avance et on pousse. C'est Canal 7 qui gagne. C'est Step Out qui gagne. Wow, wow, wow. We having our guest on the platform. Oh my God. Some people will say Ibrahim not true. Say You call that my ikam? Yes, it's true. You're welcome, barista. Thank you very much. Oh my God! Look at the way you you're glowing. You're pretty on our screen. Oh, <laughs> you know, um, ladies and gentlemen, I I've been watching this lady. I've been a fan since before I ever started to uh, do this job. And uh, watching how many platforms she's been uh, a wonderful woman, she's impact so many people have been in conferences and I watched her. She's here on our platform today, not only as a barrister, but a powerful activist. So mom, uh, before we uh, ask you any question, we'll give you the platform to present yourself and tell our televiewers who is barrister Joy Chefo. Wow. <laughs> I must say I'm first of all flattered by this. So many, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> it's not every day people tell you they watch you and they like what you do and I'm number one fan. Stuff like that. Yeah. It also gives me the push and mm -hmm. it encourages me to do the work I do. Okay. Yes. I'm a young lawyer and I just have a small um how do I call it? I just like to let people know mm -hmm. what they are supposed to do, yeah. their civic rights and their obligations. Mm -hmm. Because the problem I notice with many people in our country is, first of all, they don't know what the law requires of them. Mm -hmm. And secondly, because they don't know, they fall into little, uh, I'll call it problems or situations mm -hmm. which they could resolve themselves. So. But you see, you will see somebody is maybe uh, spending time in prison or spending huge sums of money because the person wasn't aware of just a little detail that mm. he or she could do to wow. save a situation. So basically, what I do is I educate people on the law for free. I have mm. a page that I run on Facebook, and I know wow. that is one of the platforms on which you watch me. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's because I do short videos and I upload on the page. Of course, I love I that so much educative post and mm. i share some people who have been following they mm. like you they, they they really appreciate that and 
that is what I I I love to do. Mm. I hope I answered your question. Of course you did, mm. and I believe that many people out there, those watching the platform, too scared, too scared regard the mission. Many will be like, "Hey, me man, yes, until now." So because me man no lost sense tomorrow. You know, in our country today, we we are facing intimidation, and many people are are facing uh, situations they would have got out of just because they aren't aware or just because they don't have people like you to sensitize them. Yeah. Uh, very good and it's very important you were talking about it here today. Um, we'll be very interactive and very relaxed. Sure, sure. Yeah, good. And you yeah. are you a lady and would like you to talk about uh, uh, the empowerment the empowerment of the young lady yeah. uh, to become a woman like you. Yes, so, um, because that is one of the things I also love. I do a lot of, like you said, I'm mm -hmm. an activist and mm -hmm. I do a lot of activism in the field of human rights mm -hmm. and empowerment of the girl child. Wow. Yes, because we live in a society where women have been suppressed. Mm -hmm. How do I put it? I know, I know it's always a topic that will make people want to come on and say, no, you women, you want to say you are equal to men. And this is what I say. It's not about fighting with a man and telling him I am equal to you. Yeah. But it's about making a woman know, aware of the, the, the possibilities, the, 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 the openings that she has in front of her. Because mm -hmm. most women will not take advantage of that. Mm -hmm. Because, you know, they have been relegated to the background. And yeah. they just stay there and they're like, no, this thing is not for me. I cannot be this. I cannot be that. Yeah. Because maybe this is a man's thing. Maybe this is a not... A woman's thing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So... You find most of our sisters they want to go for jobs like mm -hmm. teachers, yeah. nurses. Mm -hmm. I'm not saying that is bad, but I'm also telling women that there are also many pro other professions that you mm -hmm. can dare. Yeah. Yes, there are many things that women can like do. Like being a lawyer. Ah, uh, like being a lawyer. <laughs> if you want to say so, it's a demanding job too. But very I, demanding. Yeah, of course. I want to encourage most women to go into that mm -hmm. and. And luckily, we have too many women now in, in, in the lawyering profession. I was about to say that. Yes, we do. We do. But what I'm saying is there are women who can go into other professions. They can go into politics. They can go into too many things, mm -hmm. you know. And they shouldn't just feel like, no, I cannot do this. Or maybe my husband will not permit this because he doesn't want me to come back at this time of the night. Or mm -hmm. he doesn't want me. There is always that point where you break even. There is always that point where you, you talk with the man and you tell him, this is how I want you to be. And please, let's learn to compromise both ways and we find a solution. I believe you are, you, you're answering so many. You, 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 you're beginning to, so it, it's, just, it's just going so fast. And people are loving it. And I love it. I didn't interrupt, interrupt you because I love the way you took it. So, Mom, I, I, I'll give you one. I'll start with the first question right now, okay? Yeah. Mm -hmm. The first question is, where uh, does this process start from empowering the young girl okay i think it starts from when the baby is when she's just a baby mm. yes let me tell you i always use this example you know parents have an attitude of buying different kinds of dolls for their babies yeah the the, the, they will buy a football for the, the, the boy, the male child, and mm. then they will buy a, a doll for the girl child. Mm. Yes, so no, the girls, you know, in our society, we know that little girls need to play with dolls. Yeah. I want to <laughs> challenge you now. Why don't you buy, a, why don't you bring dolls in the house and say, okay, these are gifts for my babies. Let anyone play with anything they want to play with. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yes, and I also tell parents that for that little boy who is in the house, make him understand that his sister is equal to him. Okay, because first thing is, he knows that physically he's stronger than his sister. Mm -hmm. So what does he do? He will seize what she's playing with. Mm -hmm. And she'll cry and run to the mother and the mother will just be like, give it back. No, don't, don't just tell him to give it back to him, to her. Let he let him know. Let you need to let him know mm -hmm. that it's not just because he is physically stronger than the sister yeah. that he needs to seize whatever thing she is. Mm -hmm. 
let him understand that he needs to ask politely. Ask politely. Yes. It means uh, everything starts back at home. Education and parents, of please. Course. You need of to, course. You need to uh, uh, watch this. You need to follow up your kids. Make sure that they love and use what they want. And I, I believe today some parents are beginning to change that. Like they take their children to the supermarket, take them uh, where you could have them um, uh, toys and allow them make the choice. Make the choice. Because free. we have the Enganamui today. We mm. have them um, uh, Chut Ajara. Those are playing football. If I believe their parents See? allow them get in contact with yeah. such toys and mm -hmm. they're becoming today uh national heroes so uh, mom thank you very much for that but are there some limitations in empowering the girl child from our homes I and if there are limitations what are some of those limitations i don't i don't know what you what you i don't know what you're going to call limitations because to me i believe that when you empower a child mm -hmm. you especially a girl child mm -hmm. you're saving the whole society but I'm not saying that you need to teach the child to be rude, to be aggressive, because... Because I was about to talk about that. Yes, because most girls will want to misinterpret it and look at it from a different direction. Yeah. And that is what is causing the friction in society today. Mm. When you talk about female empowerment, most men, want, most men don't want to hear that because they, they think to. that what well, you're only talking about... Um, Maybe you're, you're, you're teaching their wives how to disrespect them. Mm -hmm. You're teaching their wives how Obviously to fight Obviously, that's how we see it in that Africa. Is, that is how you see it. But that is not what empowering a girl child is all about. Mm -hmm. I want to look at empowerment from the level where you bring her up, you raise her to the, level, to the understanding of the opportunities that she has in front of her, mm -hmm. to the fact that she is not a, a, a secondary human being because mm -hmm. most people want to think that women are uh, secondary humans mm -hmm. yes and you teach her to go about whatever things she wants to do respectfully with humility with humility of mm. course i know when to talk as well i know because when you know uh, in our society today i was i would say openly and clearly uh, i once faced one young girl back those days in the university of young the one i had serious issues we were we were, we were very good friends and uh, at one point things turned out and uh, you know, ladies, you know, in homes where parents empower, she, she's from a home where her mom really empowered uh, uh, the young. She's, her mom believes in such stuff. And uh, I was so graced because she told me before. So along the line, Barista, uh, we were friends. And it turned out that uh, it was becoming to be uh, something, uh, <laughs> you know. And with these uh, young girls who believe that they can get anything they want, because that was one of her slogans. And uh, being a stubborn guy, at one point I said, it doesn't work that way, especially when I don't want. So she got mad and started like um, placing some wrong accusations on me. And it got to the point where she took my name to one police station or whatever. And the aim was to come pick me up. So even when her mom came and listened to the allegations, she was really shocked. And one of the grace I had is I already knew how to go through some procedures uh, concerning such wrong accusations. And I had to deal with it and get along with it. So um, at the end of the day, she didn't stop, but she kept on pushing. So parents, I believe, uh, Barista, you're here to clarify such stuff. At home, empowering a young girl child doesn't mean you, you grow her, give her some horns, <laughs> and it grows so much. I believe parents should also learn how to cut of it up. Of course, out. parents are supposed to know when to cut up the excesses. Mm -hmm. Yes, because like I said, empowering a girl child is not making her rude, it's not making her bad, it's mm -hmm. not... Teach, it's not, it's not on teaching all the good manners that she should have. Yeah. It's teaching her what is right. Mm. Teaching her what sh should be the way it should be. Yeah. Yes. I'm so happy you are. You are a product of that. I'm proud of your parents because I must believe that uh, uh, <laughs> being a lawyer today has been a long procedure. Mom empowering you. You've been a strong lady. I've watched you at many conferences. You spoke before men, able men. And mm -hmm. it's, 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 it's so wonderful because you spoke... Uh, so humbly, Bert, <laughs> oh God, with, a, with authority and courage. Thank you. I notice you don't blink your eyes when you talk. You're so sure of yourself. <laughs> it's one of the ways, the face you need to wear when you're standing in front of me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Barista, thank you very much uh, for this uh, beautiful slot we'd have with you. You wouldn't leave us. We'll be having a... Uh, by the way, I would ask you, what do you think about uh, good music? What do you do throughout the weekend? Do you dance? Do you listen to music? Do you go out in... Ah, I go out a little. Mm, I love good music. You love good and music. And I sing very well. Oh my God! Mm -hmm. we'll be, we'll be, we'll be <laughs>
<laughs> we will be discovering that right now. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, we'll be welcoming on our platform one talented artist. She's called Tracy right away from uh, Boya. Um, she's a wonderful artist. Geraldine, est-ce qu'on peut avoir une pause musicale de l'artiste Tracy? Voilà, qui chante très bien la chanson Moula. Et voilà, produit par Phil Bill. For those who know Phil Bill, one of the best two to be seven producers. She's on our platform and she's giving it right. Catch you right back after this break. Thank you very much. 237 superstar artist. She is just so wonderful. You guys can check on her songs on YouTube. I have been dancing on this song. Feel me respect for what you're doing. Shaba, as you always say, it's a good thing to promote our own arts and Tracy's right here. Barrister, what do you think about the song of this beautiful? That thing? was good music. Good music? <laughs> yes, I Oh love my it. God. I can imagine myself cleaning the house and I'm listening to this song. <laughs> I'm sure if I'm listening to this, I will raise the volume, you will knock and I won't hear you. So Tracy, 
Bienvenus. It's French, right? I hope you understand that one. <laughs> of course I do. Okay. <laughs> now, who is Tracy? Who is Tracy? Many people just look at you and they say, who is this girl? A shot by a rap, if you saw. Well, Tracy is a young artist mm -hmm. who has so much love and passion for the arts, mm -hmm. especially music. Music? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And Tracy has been singing ever since in school. In her oh school days, God. Tracy had been a music prefect ever since in school. <laughs> And she had to practice that culture right up to this very moment, where she's able to write and and you know produce her own her own personal songs. songs. Yes, so. And it's been wonderful. Uh, thank you very much. I've been loving it. <laughs> you know, um, many people don't know. I have a blog page. When I fell on Tracy, uh, because of one of these stuff that trend online, I don't know. I won't talk about that here, mm -hmm. but. I was so much touched, and I wrote the young lady inbox, and she was so comprehensive. We talked. And I decided I'm going to promote whatever she's doing. When she was in Yaoundé, I wasn't even aware. Come on. That's one of the things you do. You have to deal with me after the program. Parce que tu vas me demander, pardon. Façon, j'ai compris qu'elle est à Yaoundé. Elle ne me dit pas, you're Yaoundé, you're tell me. I said, we must have something. Surely, we, the program was so stocked up. I had to suspend some people because of Tracy. Tracy, tu es la bienvenue, tu es la bienvenue, tu es la bienvenue. Oh, so we'll start with the first question. Tracy, uh -huh. has music been like as a young lady? Well, it has been really challenging, mm -hmm. you know, because I believe that we, from the way we all see things, yeah. the music industry in Cameroon is really growing every day. There yeah. are so many talented people out there mm -hmm. who are not even yet known, but are really talented. Yeah. And you see the market is really that big. Everybody mm -hmm. wants to prove to heal herself. Mm -hmm. And it's really like a struggle, but I believe that the future is bright. The future is bright. Yeah. Now, Barista, you listen to music. What, what's your word about the, the 237 industry, music? Mm. They are really on the rise. What are some of your preferences uh, as a young female artist? Young female artist. Well, I just listen to her like her. Oh. Yeah, of course. I you can't resist this woman, this <laughs> Tracy girl. Yeah, sure. Her music is good. Yeah. I'm not just saying it because I want her to blush, but yeah. I just want to encourage her to. Yeah. Oh. yeah. It's good music. Thank you. Yeah. And, uh, Which one again? Love Meshi, Meshi. Rambuse. <laughs> <laughs> yes. And you know, uh, <laughs> uh, I also love Daphne. Daphne. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Meshi, shout out to you. Meshi will be on our platform just very soon. She's working on some stuff. I love Mami Bakala. She's Mami crazy. Bakala too, right? Yeah. Ask her. <laughs> yeah. I love her so much, but some of her clicks really. But anyway, any man <laughs> wish, right? It makes her special. And I love yeah. her. Um, I've been so uh, uh, happy about the back seasons and the various stuff she's been doing, and yeah. it's been a good stuff. So we we'll come back to you, Tracy. Tracy, how many songs do you have in your discography right now? Well, for the songs that are out, mm -hmm. um, I think I have two. Mm -hmm. My own personal singles, yeah. I have two. I have a collab that I mm -hmm. did, but it's just the audio that's out. That's mm -hmm. been out like a year ago, mm -hmm. and I still have so many projects. As for recorded songs, I have close to twelve or thirteen, 12 songs. which are yet unreleased. Yeah, but I'm working on a program. My team and I were working on a program. Mm. As for this coming month, and I'll be releasing another song titled mm. Doucement. Doucement. Yeah. And I've noticed your love for French. It shows an actual example of integrity. <laughs> now tell us, why all your titles are beginning to gain, uh, uh, beginning to be in French? Well, like not... Moula, Moula, tout ce qui savent, c'est l'argent, c'est ça, non? Yeah, it's yeah. I, I don't know if Moula is really French. Mm -hmm. I, I believe it's like a word people use to call yeah. money. Mm -hmm. Because we've seen it in Stanley and video. Good. Uh, yeah. yes. I noticed in the song, you were so much... Yeah. yeah. So I was like, hey, is she from Boya? <laughs> It was really good. So tell us more about that. Well, not really all my song titles are in French. Like mm -hmm. I said, I still yeah. have many projects which okay. are coming up. Yeah. And not definitely all of them mm -hmm. are in French. Yeah. And I'm a bilingual person. Mm -hmm. I did French series in my high school. Mm -hmm. And I have a great vast of knowledge when it comes to French, yeah. to my own level. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't really say I'm best in it. Yeah, yeah so I just love the language. And, mm -hmm. I, and I believe French is a very romantic language. Language, oh, which is good. good to the ear, mm. same as English too, same because English. I really love singing in English, and I have really good songs which are yet to be released, okay. which are also in English. So oh it's not like God. I'm singing just in French. Good. I'm diverse. 
I am so much in love with the way you put your accent. <laughs> Et je you. pense que pour tous ceux qui ont écouté cette chanson de Moula, ils ont aimé. Voilà, <coughs> euh, beaucoup d'entre eux n'ont pas cru que c'est juste, c'est une artiste, euh, voilà, euh, anglophone. Elle a fait son possible à gérer tout et ça s'est bien passé. Now, uh, Barista, what do you think about the, the, the strength of this lady trying to merge English and French? That's a perfect example of a Cameroonian, right? Yes, of course. Cameroon is bilingual, so... Mm. It's a good thing she's trying to merge, but uh, I just want to say we are still waiting for the English okay. song. <laughs> yes. mm, because most of our artists tend to sing just in French. Just in French, yeah. yeah. So I think I also want to hear an English song. Let's okay. definitely appreciate it. Okay, Tracy, uh, commands have already been laid and it shows that the fan base is increasing. Mm -hmm. Now tell us about your release, Muller. How did it go? Inspiration, working with Phil Bill to its release, the public, your fans. How was it received? Yeah, first of all, what really motivated me to come up with that song, because I'm a songwriter, I write my song, so mm -hmm. what motivated me to come up with Mula, if you watch the video, the storyline, you see a woman who walks, feeds the man, the man stays at home, he does nothing, mm -hmm. and he's comfortable about it. That is something I've realized, which goes on, but people don't really take note of it. Mm -hmm. It is very obvious that men are the head of the family, they mm -hmm. take care of the family, but in some cases, there are rare cases where you find the woman who is responsible for everything that has to do with finances. Mm. And I don't know how we label those kind of guys, but I try to bring up that song to kind of educate the society, to let the society know that there are certain things that happen which are not correct. Mm -hmm. you, the fact that you're a man and you're lucky to have a woman who takes care of you, feeds you, that shouldn't encourage you to just get comfortable about the whole thing. It's mm -hmm. nice to step up as a man and take up your responsibilities in order not to lose respect in the eyes of a woman because we women, <laughs> we really do not admire men who don't do anything. See, <laughs> and she penned this down, made it in the form of a melody, and I'm sure there are some dudes out there in, this, in such a situation <laughs> dancing. S'il vous plaît, prenez un peu du temps et écoutez encore la chanson, parce que des fois il ne faut pas danser sans écouter. Yeah. Thank you very much for that, G. Yeah. How do you work with Philby? How is he? Is he a nice guy? Yeah, yeah, Philby is good. He's good and he recognizes talent, and mm. when he sees that, he does everything possible to encourage you. Encourage. Yes, because when I, when I sent the song, he, he, he first, first of all asked me to send a voice note on WhatsApp. Let him first mm. of all listen to it mm. and know if it's something good, good to work with. So when I, I sang the song, because I've written everything from the beginning to, to the, the end. end. Like that's how I write. I appreciate when I listen to that song. Yeah. It's a perfect written uh, 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 song, no? mm -hmm. That is from the beginning to the end. It shows that she didn't. Because when you listen to a song, which, has, which hasn't been written from the beginning, so you start with ah, la, 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 be, boo, da, da. <laughs> all those things you see. They didn't write them. So when you get lost, you start doing all those stuff, and it was perfect. Yeah, it was thank, good. Thank you very much. So, dear, uh, won't, uh, 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 we're so happy to have you on our platform. Thank uh, you. We have some other young artists like you. I believe you like to discover them. Yeah, definitely. Marista Chefo, mm -hmm. are you comfortable? Sure. Is everything rolling right? Very well. Good. Now you just listened to Barista before you came on our platform on Empowering a Young Lady. What do you think about that? Yeah, I really am. I really admire her for that because mm -hmm. well, there are most ladies these days that do not really discover their virtue or their power or their capability. And it's really good. <laughs> I really encourage her for that program because, first of all, I am a feminist. Mm -hmm. I love empowering women. I love seeing women grow. I love seeing women I taking you are the not challenge. Too radical. <laughs> no, not at all. Not at yeah. all. Besides being a feminist, I really know that the man really has his own respect in the society sure. being a feminist doesn't mean you should disrespect men or disrespect the power or the the position a man holds in the society hey, are we safe men please i think it's high time we begin to have i man. think she saved you on the contrary yeah. she didn't come here to say that there no, was Paris that don't catch me really <laughs> <laughs> you know i did that to pull your legs right so you say something very yeah. interesting thank you very much tracy thank you uh, very it's much. a pleasure to have you on our platform and I would like you to greet one or two people watching you right now. Um, <laughs> the family is really big. I first of all love to greet my boss, my family, everybody encouraging me. I really want to thank you all. I want to thank my mom especially. She has always been there for me. Her and prayers. your manager. My support. My manager. Oh, I can't forget that one. That She's girl is cute. <laughs> She's always there. My is beside me every the time. Bestie. Child. She's just there to encourage me. My family, my friends. I can't Very even humble. start naming them. There are just so many of them. I just want to thank everybody. Mm. It's our pleasure. Yeah. Thank you very much, Tracy, for being with us. Uh, voilà, uh, chers uh, téléspectateurs, c'est un plaisir pour nous hein, voilà, de vous présenter des talents, des meilleurs, des jeunes qui font du beau travail, qui sont euh, voilà, déterminés à relever le défi voilà, avec des grands icônes qui ont déjà ouvert la route. 
Alors, qu'est-ce qu'on va faire On va décider maintenant de prendre une autre pause musicale avec l'artiste Rapanui. Voilà, euh, on a commencé avec Rapanui et on va essayer de voir encore hein, qu'est-ce que ce jeune homme propose. Mais Jardine, cette pause musicale ne serait pas si longue. On va décider de prendre juste une, un petit bout et puis on revient juste après avec l'artiste sur la plateforme. Catch you right back. Abalegi, Maganga, la la la. Hey, c'est Rapanui, uh -huh. sur le beat de Blanche et Belly. Uh -huh. hey, oh, hey, oh, hey, oh, les gars sont morts. Belly et Blanche, et c'est beat up. Mais c'est sa life, moi je m'en tape. J'ai pas le temps, je vois la lune cap. Pour chop la map, pour tout la chat. On l'a avec, comme on l'a. La fille de la yeux, c'est le vrac. Elle est belle, c'est le mens. Son visage m'a donné la règle à Jack Je sais pas si l'argent faut le bonheur Hier yeah, j'ai vu un bonbon qui était en pleurs Mais je sais que pour voter c'est malheur Le tout si j'ai vu avec les dos du tailleur J'ai laissé un charmant ressuscité Parce que j'avais pas ça au bout la capote Chérie si je te pense c'est pas c'est pas C'est parce que je cotise le boubé La jeune L'homme de femme La jeune L'homme de femme La jeune L'homme de femme la jeune, l'homme de femme Dinero, le CD, le cap, le riz, le nom soldé Dalanko, Dalanko, Bongo, Moni, oh ouais Dinero, le CD, le cap, le riz, le nom soldé Dalanko, Dalanko, Bongo, Moni, oh ouais Trouver la jeune est devenu du comme gagner pour polo sélection Dès que tu es un petit gymnase, ça t'excite le tout si même l'ego entre en érection pas la propreté du porte-monnaie à l'intérieur la jambe est sale Obligé de use MT elle me baille monnaie Je n'ai pas les pièces pour bailler les orages Ah la go tchao les nouvelles de rap à nuit Qui le gars foiré là Il est même barré depuis Et en plus on l'a envoyé au nord chez les beaux quarum là-bas Ah c'est le gars alors brise hein Il a eu la bousse Il go mbeng Dans deux semaines Ah bon eh Maman la jambe de ça Maman le gars là ça va y jouer mon téléphone on m'a fait que à Maroua, tu dis ne pas vouloir relation à distance Dès que tu entends que je go en bain Qui est plus loin, là tu changes Tu me parles de mariage Woko, wombo les femmes Avec le calculage Dis-toi on calme ta rage La jambe, l'homme de femme 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 <laughs> oh là là, ladies and gentlemen, this is the young guy Rapanui. Voilà, moi ça me plaît, ça me touche. Voilà, je suis juste privilégié parce que c'est ça. That's how it goes. You know, um, en tant qu'animateur, la grâce, you know, as a TV host, the grace you have is to meet talents and you bring them on your platform, promote them. Moi ça me fait ça. Oh là là, <laughs> on dirait choker. I'm very happy. Alors Rapani, tu es la bienvenue. C'est pas la première fois que tu suis. Non, c'est pas la première fois. C'est pas la première fois. Voilà. Et alors comment ça se passe alors avec le, le remix Parce que moi-même j'étais là. Oui. Mais après que le remix est sorti, comment ça s'est passé Non, c'est c'est une avalanche. C'est une avalanche. Ça tue, ça, ça, ça tue, ça tue, ça tue. <rire> moi-même je suis. Yeah, C'est-à-dire que les gars partagent ça comme les arachides, donc ça part, c'est partout. C'est partout, c'est partout, c'est partout. Vraiment, Et ça... on a kiffé, on a kiffé. Les gens kiffent, les gens ne font que kiffer, les gens ne font que rekiffer, vraiment. Les gens ne font que repartager ça. Eh, hey, gars, il faut dire que tu as les dos, hein. <rire> les dos du clip, là. <rire> ça... Alors parle-nous un peu, euh, euh, voilà, va... c'est vrai qu'il y a beaucoup de personnes qui connaissent Rapanui, oui, mais oui. il y a des gens qui te découvrent aujourd'hui, il y a des personnes oui, qui oui. te voient juste aujourd'hui. Oui. Voilà, ce que je veux, c'est que tu nous donnes une petite hein, voilà, biographie de toi, voilà, oui. quelque chose de plus bref, comme ça ceux qui ne te connaissent pas puissent te connaître. Bon, Rapanui, c'est un, un architecte d'abord, donc je suis architecte, architecte et je suis rappeur aussi, mmh. voilà. Euh, mon nom c'est Tchango Cyril, mon nom est naissance, mmh. Rapanui c'est mon nom d'artiste, donc... Disons que ça fait bientôt un an que je me suis lancé dans la musique. Donc on va dire grosso modo, c'est un peu ça. Euh, disons que... Moi je te vois <rire> avec Tracy faire un featuring. 
Ah, c'est intéressant. Ça serait bien, <rire> n'est-ce pas? Ah, ouais. Oui, parce que euh, une des choses que je j'aimais avec one of the things I love about my platform Step Out is the fact that in the space of just one year, I'm happy about the collabs. Je suis fier avec les collaborations qui sont passées ici. Mm -hmm. Il y a des personnes qui sont venues, sont rencontrées. C'est ça l'essentiel. Parce que si je te vois avec Tracy faire un featuring à la fin de la journée, toi tu voyages pour Boya, elle est voyage pour Yaoundé. Qu'est-ce que tu penses? Mm -hmm. <rire> ouais, c'est intéressant. Oui, parce ouais. qu'après l'émission, vous pouvez parler de cela et puis euh, vous sortez un truc et il y a une vidéo et vous tuez pour tuer. Non, on tue, on finit avec ça. <rire> Alors, Tracy, what do you think about that song of this young guy? He did a remix of Blanche Bailey's Agent. Mm -hmm. what, what, what's your feeling? What's your point of view? Yeah, first of all, that song, I really love it. And mm -hmm. him coming up with his own style. Oh. You no, know, killing the beats again. He yeah. really did it. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, he did, he did very well. I actually loved it. I love the remix. Oh, the le gars. <laughs> Quand tu dis des choses comme ça, qu'est-ce que tu veux ça? Ça fait un genre là, mon frère. Genre, le, goût, le goût de ça, comme on dit souvent là. Le goût de ça, là. Que le goût de ça. Oh, ça ok, plaisir, ladies and gentlemen, let's listen from Rapa Nui now. Alors, frérot, après cette chanson, quels sont tes projets euh, voilà, Oui, oui, il y, a, il, y a, il y a un prochain son qui arrive. Il faut vraiment que on continue à travailler dans le même sens. Donc, ouais. comme les gens ont aimé là, euh, l'équipe et moi, on est en train de travailler. Nous sommes déjà sur le prochain projet. Ouais. Donc, et, ça va tomber très très rapidement, le plus tôt possible. Ouh là là, j'ai été là, voilà, pendant le tournage de ce clip. Il faut dire que tourner un clip, c'est pas facile. Ouais. J'ai transpiré ma balle là-bas dedans. Mm -hmm. Ok, tu danses. Le réalisateur te dit, bon, c'est vrai, c'est pas fini. Ok, tous les gars en veste là, refaites la même chose. Mm -hmm. On le refait. Et ça n'a pas été facile, ça a été difficile. So, dear, tell us, when you're doing a clip, what are some of the challenges you go through? Man, like, when the... the... <laughs> Those in charge tell mm -hmm. you, okay, this style you did, you didn't really do it well, do it again. Mm -hmm. You understand? And you get tired, but you still have to. You Sometimes you even smile when you're tired. Oh. And the smile is not even natural, but mm -hmm. you, you just have to smile. Oh, because you're tired and you have to redo the same the same uh, uh, um, style, the same gesture, the same. If they say, okay, this is how you smile, this smile was not really good. Try to brighten up your teeth a little bit. Yeah. Try to, you oh. know, your, the moves. It's just so stressful, it's but, so but stressful. the love for the passion just keeps you going. You don't it even see it going. like tiring. You just want the best. So. That's the beautiful part of it. That end, I love it. The mm -hmm. love for the passion. Frero, quels sont les challenges que tu as eu pendant le tournage de ce clip? Il faut dire que tu es l'homme qui est plus bossé. T'as dit, oh, t'as mal à ce Je s'agit vraiment reprendre, 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 reprendre et reprendre. On a repris les scènes fatiguées. Au oh, montant, on descendait, je montais, de, je montais à gauche pour faire telle scène, je descendais pour faire telle scène. Vraiment, <rire> c'était compliqué. On a repris beaucoup de scènes, vraiment, c'est fatigant. fatigant. Ouais. fatigant. On danse, fin... on danse, on danse, on danse. Mais à la fin, tout le monde est content. Et tout le monde est content, c'est ce que j'aime. Voilà, je salue hein, voilà, euh, le, le réalisateur, euh, il s'appelle. Euh, 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 chacal, chacal, chacal c'est mon camarade de classe. On a fait géographie ensemble à l'université de Yaoundé 1. Voilà, donc ça, c'est de youths appreciate parce que pendant qu'on était à l'école, we were taking some notes in geography. Those are some of the guys who honor their talent. Ils ont honoré les talents, ils ont fait ce qu'il fallait faire. You know, back those days, I used to use my phone. J'utilisais mon téléphone pour interviewer certains de mes camarades. Et on riait. We used to laugh at it. I never knew that I'll be here. And I believe that from here, we are going high. Et c'est le cas. On ne fait que foncer, on parle que des vents. Non. À bas l'air. Ma ganga me posait des vents. <rire> oh là 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 là. Alors frérot, qu'est-ce que tu peux dire à tous tes fans qui ont soutenu la chanson et pour ceux qui veulent consommer Vraiment, euh, pour tous ceux qui soutiennent la chanson, mille fois merci parce que le soutien a été Bien colossal. Oh vous là là, que les gars, tu... les, 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 Même les inconnus partageaient ça comme si c'était idée devant le frère. Vraiment, je dis merci <rire> à tous les fans qui n'arrêtent pas de partager et qui continuent d'ailleurs à partager. Ouais, mm -hmm. et c'est ça. Et à tous ceux qui n'ont pas encore suivi, allez-y les gars, vous ne serez pas dessus. Le son est vraiment bon. On allez vraiment sur travail. YouTube, tapez Rap à Nuit, remix Agent Blanche Bailey et vous allez juste kiffer. N'hésitez pas à télécharger. Est-ce qu'il y a d'inconvénients à cela Non, il n'y a pas d'inconvénients. Téléchargez, vous partagez, allez-y. Vraiment, voilà, vous le cas. Et par rapport au concert, qu'est-ce que tu dis à tous les organisateurs des, des événements Est-ce que tu es ouvert au concert Mais bien évidemment, bien évidemment. Parce que c'est. Hein? Bah, mais bien sûr, bien sûr. <rire> Tracy, <laughs> 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 Tracy, what can you say to organize uh, those who organize events and other like? I hope you're open for for concerts. Yeah, definitely. Uh, I'm I'm always available. Always, always available. Yeah. 
Tracy is available. The two, the two artists sont, uh, voilà, disponible. Tracy is available. If you want Tracy for your events, marriage, but most often I believe that it will be good you guys call them up for concerts, les deux, and grant them the time to do what they can do. After the big bros, allow the young ones to come in front and do their best. Parce que je pense que c'est ce qu'il faut faire, non? Voilà, après que les grands ont, euh, euh, on vous laisse faire la première partie des concerts de vos grands frères, they leave you guys do that and it's gonna be fun. Mm -hmm. Voilà, ok. Euh, rap à nuit, on revient vers toi. Qu'est-ce que maman et papa ont ressenti après ce tuement là Ah, ils étaient... C'était l'euphorie, c'était l'euphorie, c'était très content. Oh très là content, là, 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 là. <rire> Il faudrait dire que toi, tu, euh, tes fans sont vraiment des personnes qui te soutiennent parce que le jour où j'étais là, pendant le clip, ça a été extrêmement super. C'est-à-dire, j'ai vu toute une foule pas possible. Des gens ont été là. And I saw the same thing on your clip, Tracy. You guys have a very powerful fan base. How do you get that <laughs> it's just hard work, I believe, and you know, good work is always appreciated, no matter how, mm -hmm. no matter how much effort you make. When someone sees good work, it's just now, it's just natural for the person to appreciate. To appreciate. Yes. That's wonderful. Alors, frérot, on a deux minutes avec toi. Qu'est-ce que tu peux dire à nos chers téléspectateurs ceux qui te regardent maintenant? Bon, continue à se tenir à pas nuit. Et vraiment, je vous assure, on ne vous décevra pas parce que du lourd est en train d'arriver. Et tu as oh. dit à Blanche Bailey qu'elle met son humour en commentaire. Tu vas la faire un dépôt. Mais bon. c'est pour ça bien. Oui, c'est pour ça bien parce que elle a d'abord tué le son d'abord. Elle même d'abord son son d'abord. Son son est très bien. Donc elle, ça... elle mérite une bien. Une bien. <rire> Blanche Bailey, j'espère que tu as déposé ton limoire en commentaire pour qu'on te fasse un dépôt là. Oh. Hein? C'était pour ta bien. Parce que la façon que tu as tué le son là, le petit a plus encore. Il a tué ça a tué. Donc vraiment on apprécie. Et, uh, ladies and gentlemen, that's the beautiful slot we had with these two beautiful people. We had Tracy and Rapa Nui. C'était intéressant. Oh, ouais. Et je pense que, euh, pour ceux qui regardent l'émission, on ne peut qu'encourager les jeunes artistes. Pour ceux qui ont des clips, des beaux sons, on ne veut pas du n'importe quoi quand même, gars. Les gars, c'est ça, nos gars. Il faut entrer en studio, travailler en vrai. What do you think? You guys go into the studio and work for real. No need to jump up and down doing mm -hmm. that things. So, Géraldine, on peut avoir une petite pause avec l'artiste, la chanson de l'artiste, Brice et on revient tout juste après gérer les choses comme ça se passe sur Step Out. C'est sur Canal 7 Live. On revient juste après. The way that you want in your ways, really make me crazy. The way that you want in your ways, I promise to stand by you. Eh? Oh, nana. Oh, nana. Our love, na selele. Selele, yeah, selele When you day in a place, yeah You make them boys a holla Baby, make me relate to you See my lady, yeah You are one in the million See my lady, yeah See the one in your backside, baby You didn't make me the crazy I see the one in your backside, baby You go do me collab I see the one in your backside, baby You didn't do me confirm I see the one in your backside, baby You go do me collab For your body, yeah. see my lady, yeah. you are one in the million. See my lady, yeah. I'm a time to live for love. Come on, lady, yeah. say lele, say lele, say lele, baby, oh. say lele, say lele, say lele. See my lady, see the one in your backside, baby. You didn't make me the crazy. I see the one in your backside, baby. You go do me collab. I see the one in your backside, baby. You didn't do me confirm. The young ones are making it. They are coming, and here we have one of the one of those youths in Yaoundé working so hard to be at the top list, and it's called Briskana. Briskana, you're welcome on our platform. Thank you very much. It's my pleasure. Oh my God! One of the things I love about you is the fact that you look so gentle in your outfit. Wow. Um. Someone said that before. Mm -hmm. uh, <coughs> just that I'm brought up in the way 
you know, my family, my relative, all of us look gentle, so we keep with the spirit. You keep that spirit? Yeah. And I believe it's part of you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very interesting. Um, we just saw that beautiful song of you. What can you say about that? Okay, this song, this song was written in the year 2015. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that was when I, I, I decided to do my first single mm -hmm. in 2015. Mm -hmm. While working on this song, I had a problem somewhere mm -hmm. because actually I got into a friend who is a mechanic and he was so in love with this girl, oh. that is a rich girl. Oh, so the guy was afraid, was scared. He came to me and said, Briscana, what can we do about this? Look at this girl, I'm in love with this girl. And did so the girl I, love him? I don't know, I don't know. For now, the guy did not even know. Mm -hmm. So when we were talking about the issue, the guy went there, things were not really working, but in order for me to prove to him that he can do it, I decided to come out with this song, mm -hmm. to write this song in order to encourage him, mm -hmm. give him more pressure for him to go for what he's I believe what for. you're saying, but it's totally, to it's really hard. But I've never had that difficulty though in my life because I would say clearly, I know the height. For people who say relationship is only between poor, poor and rich, rich, sincerely I've had, I've never had a problem. I've interacted with very good people, just my principles, you know, would only separate us, that's it. So it's, I believe in what you're saying and I believe in your song. The message is just wonderful, oh, and yeah. uh, we'll be talking about that uh, uh, shortly. So let's come back to our, uh, our barrister here. You listen to her talk about empowerment of the young lady, of the young girl. What do you think? You know, when I when I listen to her mm -hmm. talking about the empowerment of young lady, I've met with many of these young lady out there that they 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 they, they are just there. They give up. They give up for whatsoever they want to do. They don't. They, they think everything in this life is all about money or maybe maybe Godfather. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but I think if you put yourself together you and you have it. that idea, you can make it. Good, mom. I come back to you straight to the point. How can we empower the young girl? Okay, since you're being straight to the point, I'll give you just four basic ways through which you can empower a young lady. Yeah. The first thing is through education. Education. Yep, yep. Help a young lady go to school. Mm -hmm. Pay fees for a young lady. Wow. Buy books, support a young lady in any way you can because mm. education is a key that will open every other door. That's the first thing. Mm. The second thing is help a young lady get a business. Mm. Help empower a young lady to do some handicraft, to do something with the hands, yeah. you know, maybe learn a, yeah, learn a trade, mm -hmm. maybe uh, do hair, maybe dresses, these things, these are beats, beats. And, yeah. There is a lot of money in these small things. Mm -hmm. The moment they get busy and they get focused, it helps them, it distracts them from other things mm -hmm. that are not supposed to supposed be in their be. lives. Good. The third thing is, in Cameroon now we are facing a crisis and mm -hmm. Most young ladies in crisis zones, they need help. Yeah. They need help in one way or the other. Talk to one of them. Get, you need to talk to people to be able to know the kind of things you can do for them, mm -hmm. the kind of things you can afford for them. Mm -hmm. So talk to a young lady in a crisis situation and let them know that you are there to support them. Support you can create them. a safe space for mm -hmm. them. And uh, also help a young mother who just put to bed. Wow. Yes, because... That one touched you. Touch me. Yeah, Touch most of me. them who just put to bed, they will be needing a lot of help in one way or the other. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't know what to go there. Are too many of them. Too many of yeah, them. Yeah, you can also mentor a young girl. Mm. But I'm not telling any kind of person to mentor because there are lots of people who will give the wrong kind of advice. Mm. Yes, if I want to say somebody who is sound upstairs. An, an example. Yes, an example. In the Ladies society. and gentlemen, uh, if, I, if, I was, if I was a young lady and I'm watching this program, <clears throat> it would be no argument that Barrister Joy Chief will be my mentor <laughs> because mm. I'll just go on Facebook, type, and get to her page, write her. You know, go to her normal account on Facebook, write her, and say, Mom, I beg, I beg you, mentor me. You know, one of the things I love about her is the fact that she incites greatness in you. She brings out the power in you. Mm -hmm. You know, this is one of those publicities we had with one of our brewery industries, Guinness, in those days with Michael Power. <laughs> they said, bring out the power in you. I believe that same slogan goes with Barista, Joy Cheerful. She's there for you. And for those who have forums, ONGs, you want good speakers, motivational speakers. She's just the right person teaching these girls what to do. So, mom, let's get to our young artists, right? We are mm -hmm. close to the end of the program. So, Briscana, 
What can you tell your fans and those listening to your music? What can they, how can they do to get to your song? <laughs> Actually, I have many things to tell my fans. Yeah. But because of no time, mm -hmm. because of no time, what I wish to tell them is that I thank them for everything they have been doing to me. Mm -hmm. And especially, especially these people that started off with me. Mm -hmm. People from Bali Kumbat. Bali Kumbat? Bali Kumbat. Is it right? Mm, no. How do they say? Do you mean good afternoon? What? Yeah, I just, I just greet Good it. afternoon. Okay, let's, let's just greet in Bali, Bali mm -hmm. Kumbat. Mm -hmm. Let's say, Unkume. Unkume. Ah, that is Bali Nyonga. Bali just, Kumbat. Ah, I, I greeted you. Okay, you, Bali, Bali, you greeted in Bali Nyonga. Yes. yes, mm -hmm. yes. So this is Bali Kumbat, mm -hmm. Unkume. Mm -hmm. So what I want to tell them is that let them keep supporting me and I promise them like in the beginning, the end is still to come. The end is not still now. to come. Yeah. Oh my God. Yeah, you can. Mommy, listen that one. Mm -hmm. It carry proper very badly. <laughs> so uh, that's very interesting, Briscana. Um, first thing we apologize with you is the fact that we didn't spend much time with you. Okay. But I'll openly say it here. I'm granting you a free comeback on this program. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you. I'll clap to that. Thank you. So I'll be calling you next Wednesday. You'll be my guest here, so we we'll talk more about you. Okay. Right? Okay. So we apologize. You know, we had a barista here, and uh, the young ladies out there really need to listen to her that's and true. you too. That's and that's true. why we merged entertainment with sensitiz sensitization. That's but true. it was very evident that you come first. So we see you, and at the end of the day, we are going to have you back again for those who are seeing you. Ladies and gentlemen, go on YouTube, type Briscana. And what's the title of that song? Seleya. Seleya. Yeah. Seleya is very interesting. Go download. And for those who believe they can't go out and reach people, it's wrong. They are human beings. Let them love you, and then you will know they are very, very <laughs> simple people. I know the fear, man, man. See, if I love you, I give you what I know I can give. That's just a simple thing. Give what you have. You have the tree, like you, you will die. If you don't have the money, see, I'm not coming for money. I'm coming for heart. I love you. <laughs> I love you looking at me. Like I love my televiewers. Oh, la, la. We are end of the program. Uh, what can I say? Well, we'll say bye-bye now. Okay, we would say bye bye to everybody watching the program. It was a pleasure. We love you. It's your humble TV servant. Ibrahim aka Hansengu on Facebook. Some people say, why did they call you Hans and then we hear you say Ibrahim? Sorry, that's how it has to be for now. We'll talk about that later. Mama, bye. We love you.